Starting February 12, there won't be a mandatory limit for private gatherings, but we recommend to limit yourself to 10 people or three bubbles. We ask you to evaluate your risks. We need to learn to live with the virus. Also on February the 12th, restaurants will have tables of 10 people or three bubbles. Starting February 14, we'll restart, uh, restart sports matches. Outdoor shows will also be allowed to host up to 5,000 people. Starting February 21, all stores will be allowed to operate at full capacity. For amphitheaters, it will be 50% capacity. And for places of workshop, it will be 50% capacity with a maximum of 500 people. Starting February 28, we'll restart competitions and sport tournaments. It won't be mandatory to work from home anymore. Amphi uh, theaters and places of worship, of worship will reopen at full capacity except for Bell Center and Video Center, and will reopen bars and casinos at 50% capacity without dance and karaoke. Finally, starting March 14, dance and karaoke will be allowed. Restaurants, bar, and large amphitheaters will reopen at full capacity. So after March 14, almost all restriction will be lifted. We're talking, uh, taking a calculated risk to learn to live with the virus. And the best way to live with the virus is to get your three doses of vaccine. No. Um, uh, we are asking uh, public health since a few weeks now to have a plan. Unfortunately, until last night, uh, they told us that uh, there, there was too much uncertainty to be able to table this kind of plan. But last night, they said that uh, the risk is a calculated risk and we can uh, go uh, forward. So. Uh, we were waiting for the okay of the uh, public health. But you saw That's the... It. Okay, sorry, I, I cut you off. Can you... No, no, but uh, uh, of course, like you in the last uh, weeks, uh, I would say since uh, the beginning of January, we see that the population is fed up. I'm fed up, we're all fed up. So uh, I can understand, but the reason why we resist until today is because uh, uh, there was too much risk uh, about uh, the situation in our hospitals. We wanted to be sure that we'll be able to uh, take care of each patient. 